Hello, this is Patrick Durkin from the Wellness Enterprise. Today I'm creating a six-part video series for you to help you understand structured water and the difference that it's made with my mental clarity, with my digestion, with my skin, with my energy, my creativity, with my connection to my soul purpose, and all sorts of things. I'm really inspired by all the changes that I've experienced in my life since beginning with structured water, and I want to share them with you. So the first thing is a comment about why we're doing six videos on this today. And the reason for six is that uh, there's one for each side of the hexagon. And the hexagon is a very important part of structured water. It's a part of the sacred geometry that allows the water to uh, ha carry the energy of creation, the, the resonance of creation. And uh, that's why we're doing six videos. So in this first one, let's talk a little bit about the discoveries of structured water science. There's three that I'd like to point out to you today, and there will be links underneath the video below that you can take a look at and um, get further information on these. So the first is the work of Dr. Masuru Emoto, who taught us that water is a living being. It's a alive consciousness, and he demonstrated this through water crystallization photographs. We're going to show some to you right now. And these were photos that, doc, that you were made using the Dr. Emoto protocol to demonstrate the difference of the Javara products that we uh, offer. So take a look at the, the um, Javara photos and notice the before and after and how the, um, the water crystals look very beautiful after they've gone through the Javara devices. So Dr. Emoto, we have a, a great gratitude for, for teaching us that water is alive. We also have great gratitude for Dr. Pollock from the University of Washington, the bioengineering department, where they have discovered a type of water they call exclusion zone water. It's another word for structured water. And some of the properties of that water are just amazing. Dr. Um, Pollock has demonstrated that water acts like a battery when it's in this structured water state. That means you can add energy to it and the energy is actually retained by the water. And water that is more energized, of course, means a more energized us. So if you'd like to get more information on Dr. Pollock's uh, research, you're welcome to click on uh, the link below this video. And then the third thing that I'd like to share with you is there are a lot of discoveries happening right now with DNA. And we're discovering that there are changes happening in who we are, um, our physical characteristics, our behavioral characteristics that are connected to changes in our DNA. It's not as fixed as we thought it was. And if you'd like to learn more about that, there's a uh, documentary, Water the Great Mystery, and in it they um, reveal some uh, science that came from Russian scientists who did a uh, experiment with water that, where they had fish in water and they sent electromagnetic impulses into the water and that caused a whole new generation of that fish to be born in the next generation. They were actually born with spots and they behave differently. So if fish can change from one generation to, the, to another just by an electromagnetic signal, how can we change? What's possible for us? The story of structured water is one about what is possible for us. And um, we're going to move forward into other aspects of that in the next video.